chicken coop is coming along it's just about done uh, yesterday I put a window in it and today I put in a vent and did some um, trim work and uh, some insulation uh, and it's coming along pretty good foam insulation seems to fill all the gaps and my wife uh, is painting it. I don't, that's her department, a lot of paint work crap, so I'm not painting. But, um, yep, it's uh, hopefully this weekend we'll be getting the chickens in here. I've got three possibilities for a run. Um, one is to move the Harbor Freight uh, garage in a box frame over here, clad it with uh, fencing, and today the netting chicken netting for the top came in so we can i can go with that uh the other option would be to uh i have some fence posts to stall a run out here with fence posts and then of course do the top uh with netting uh then there's also a possibility of uh just building a two by four run right out here and doing the same thing cladding it with fencing and I do have the, the netting for the top. And then finally, um, uh, this use existing uh, kennel that I've been using, adding one section to it. And if I add one section to it, it'll double it because I we don't need a fourth wall there. It'll be up, uh, the building will be a wall. Then of course I got to cut the little door out uh, for the chickens to uh, get in and out which won't be too hard to do. Uh, the thing is I want it to be somewhat uh, accessible from the outside so I gotta run some type of a pulley system or something so the, the door can open up from the outside and let them out. And uh, that's it. So now be a lot of, a lot of early morning uh, mornings now to uh, let the chickens up right now when they're in free range uh, they have the food and, and, and water and stuff we don't need to get out here until later but now uh, since they're going to be in a coop or cooped up <laughs> I guess you can say um, yeah we're going to have to get out a little out earlier but uh, that's it for now uh, thanks for watching and comments and uh, uh, please subscribe